<laughs> Shelly, how is chemistry developing between Derek Carr and Amari Cooper? Oh, I thought you were going to ask me about the chemistry at the vineyards. I can tell you probably more about that. Kevin, get ready to hear a lot of Carr to Cooper. Mm -hmm. We watched it in practice today. It was pretty amazing. At every drill that they ran, Derek Carr, the very first pass, went to Amari Cooper, and he didn't disappoint. He was dynamic. They're using him in a number of different ways in the slot at wide receiver, and he's somebody that they really counted on and they needed. They also got Michael Crabtree, so now he has two weapons to see, you know, second and third options, if you will, if they are not the first option. But uh, Amari Cooper really impressed a lot of people. He already impressed Jerry Rice, who said he reminded him of the next Tim Brown. Tim Brown, who gets inducted into the Hall of Fame on Saturday. That's something Derek Carr could work with. He's so explosive. You know, he's so good in and out of his breaks. Um, you know, that's where he's special. And that's what you saw in college, how special he was. You know, he's learning how to play with his hands more, you know, because there's a lot more press coverage, obviously, in the NFL. Um, you know, so uh, the more that he's growing, the more that he's learning, he, he's getting better, you know, rapidly. He's uh, extremely serious about, about football, about learning and getting on, on the same page with the quarterbacks and, and with Derek. And, um, we're learning how to be a pro. I think he's done a great job coming into camp and just going to going to work. The team had about a two and a half hour practice this morning. They just came through for meetings before their walkthroughs. They look a little tired. It's a little hot up here, but it's not bad. One thing that's different about this camp as a pre from previous camps is the energy. There is high energy here. They've got the music going. They've got players screaming and yelling. And I said, it's not just the fans anymore. It's the players actually moving quickly back and forth. It's very reminiscent of the Pete Carroll days at USC or up in Seattle. In fact, there are several members of the USC staff who were here on Jack Del Rio staff, including Ken Norton Jr., who is the new defensive coordinator. That man can move faster than just about anybody on this field. I think he could still play, actually, John.